welcome to the session in this class we'll uh, look at a few numericals on the basic current mother what we discussed in last lecture so uh, we'll start with the circuit what we discussed last class So these are the uh, things given. The circuit is same. So it is given that IRF is equal to uh, 100 microamps. I naught is equal to 200 microamps. And uh, W by L of 1. So this is Q1 and this is Q2. And given that W by L of 1 is equal to 20 and L2 is given as 2 micrometers and the transistor parameters are mu and C of is equal to 100 microamps per volt square and Vt is equal to 0.5 volt. So you are supposed to find uh, W2 and R. These are the questions. So by looking at the circuit, we know that this is a current mirror circuit. And uh, <clears throat> one more thing we know, we have the, we studied in last class that the current I naught is actually, or uh, we have written in last class, I naught by I ref is equal to, last class we use the notation ID1 and ID2 or whatever it is. So I naught by I ref is equal to W by L of 2 divided by W by L of 1. This is what uh, we discussed in last class, right? So I naught is given, IRF is given. So I can directly write uh, W by L of 1 is given. So I can, this gives W by L of 2 as I naught by IRF into W by L of 1. So if I do that, it is 200 micro divided by, sorry, well done. Yeah, correct. 200 micro divided by 100 micro into 20, uh, which is same as 40. So W value of 2 is given as 40. Uh, L2 is given as 2. So your W2 is equal to 80 micrometer. Right. This is given that W2 by L2 is given as 40. So when your L2 is equal to 2 micrometer, your W2 should be 80. Now, one more, so W2 is not. Now, one more thing is given, it is R, the value of resistance R. How to find the value of resistance R? Yeah, so if you look at the circuit diagram, R is equal to VD, which is 1.8 minus uh, this voltage. This voltage is same as the VGS voltage here. 1.8 minus VGS divided by IRF. In this VGS is actually unknown. How to find VGS? Yeah. So I know the current through the MOSFET in order to find VGS. I know that IRF is half mu and C ox W by L VGS minus VT the whole square. So here all parameters are given. Uh, if you look at the uh, question, all parameters are given. Uh, IRF is given as uh, 100 microamps half into your mu and C ox is given as 100 microamps and this is W by L of 1 into W by L of uh, 1 is given as 20 and VGS minus 0.5 the whole square. So from this you can find VGS. So I'll cancel these two. Uh, this and this 20. So your VGS minus 0.5, the whole square equal to 0.1, which if you do it, you will get VGS as 0.816 volt. So VGS is 0.816, you can find your R as 1.8 minus 0.816 divided by reference current IRF is uh, 100 microamps. 
So we'll get it as nine point eight. 